Hey guys, Matt Philly here, and today we're gonna take a look at four different row cap mice and see how they perform in Fortnite, which I know is like the cool trendy thing, and I may or may not be hopping on a bandwagon, but <laughs> yeah. Anyways, also wanna give a big shout out to Mass Drop for sponsoring this video. They have a drop right now going on for these four mice, so if you wanna get them at the lowest available price, then do it now by clicking the link in the description. But with that said, Let's get right into it. First up is the Rokat Cone Pure. This is $80. Like all the other ones, it's 12,000 DPI, and this one weighs 88 grams, which is the lightest out of all of them. So let's give it a shot. It's probably really hard to see, but um, I have Rokat Swarm installed, which is the software to control uh, not only the RGB settings, which all of these mice have, um, but also the DPI, and you can also assign buttons and all that fun stuff. And there's even more in the software, and of course you can have different profiles and blah, blah, blah. Um, but for some reason, the, the window is just so small on the laptop, I actually scaled up all of the settings in Windows and this didn't change, but now the rest of my laptop looks like it's for a 90 year old woman um, But yeah, for some reason it's so small. I don't know um, But I, I actually do like the software aside from the fact that it looks like it's made for ants So this mouse is pretty good I do think the thumb area is a little slippery for my liking because it's so smooth But the two thumb buttons which is standard uh, Feels pretty good very clicky and DPI changers nice scroll wheels nice overall nice mouse Next up is the Rokat Cone EMP. This is the cheapest one, which is 70 bucks, and it's 12,000 DPI as well. This one is 116 grams. So side to side, you can see the EMP is huge. It literally is like ginormous. And when you put it in your hand, and I know this is gonna be taken out of context, but uh, the, the Pure is just so small, and I, I do actually prefer that because this one feels like way too much in my hand. And it's not really a heavy mouse by any means, but it's just like, the, the shape of it, I'm not a big fan, but as far as the buttons and all that, it's really exactly the same as the Pure. Still very slippery here. Overall, not much different from the Pure. Next up is the Rokat Cone Amo, which is 80 bucks. It is 130 grams, which is four grams off of the heaviest mouse we're looking at today. So let's check it out. The Amo is actually kind of big as well, almost bigger than the EMP, but the shape of it, how it kind of comes up more in the center is a little more enjoyable for me. So I don't mind it as much, um, but this one, is almost the same, except it does have the thumb button, thumb button three right here, which is a really nice feature to have. If you're playing Fortnite, you drop a floor, you smash your thumb down on that, and you like it. And overall, just the look of it, the LEDs, I think it's probably the nicest one we've seen so far. Uh, definitely enjoying it. Finally, we have the Rokat Leader, which is the most expensive at $140, also 12,000 DPI, 134 grams, making it the heaviest, and it's also packing a 1,000 milliamp battery, which gives it 20 hours, and it has 14 buttons, which is just nuts. I would say the Leader is probably the most comfortable for me, just the way it fills out my hand. It just feels nice. I feel like I have a good grip of the buttons, uh, but you also have to be aware, having so many buttons, you could accidentally trigger something. Uh, so we do have the, the bottom thumb button right here, thumb buttons right here, and then a paddle, which is definitely interesting. Uh, you also have a left and right uh, buttons, which probably are great for building in Fortnite. You have a paddle right here as well. And overall, it's not like super crazy in the LEDs like the Amo was, um, but you know, with the buttons, it's just a cool looking mouse. And most importantly, this is wireless. You can tell by the prongs here. Uh, and the, the coolest part, I think, is that you have a wireless dock. So when you're done using it, or you're taking a break, whatever the case is, and you wanna charge it up, just do this. And there's zero lag, which is really important. And this just, look at that, that looks so cool. Definitely the coolest mouse of the day. But let's see how it actually performs in Fortnite. Going tilted. So really we're here to test out. So this is me building with that. I guess so. This person sucks. I didn't even switch my, I, I hate you. I'm actually really not a fan of how light this mouse is. It's like, it weighs like literally nothing. This was the lightest of them all. Um, the pure, not really my cup of tea. Next up, we're doing the EMP. This is a little bit of a bigger one. Let's see how it goes. Yeah, what's up, bitch? I may be default skin, but I got this. Oh, okay, I got that too. Come on, ah! Uh. Oh, great, this is the perfect weapon to get when you're on laptop. That is 
just not fair. The EMP is definitely not the perfect Fortnite mouse if you're looking for a lot of buttons because of the two, um, but I would say it's good. It's a nice size, feels good in the hand. Um, I just, I don't know. I just, for some reason I lost that battle. Am I blaming the mouse? Eh, yeah. You know, it occurred to me that maybe I should have actually recorded this off of my really nice computer that can actually run Fortnite. Um, but for some reason I'm using a cell phone hotspot with a laptop that doesn't have a good graphics card in it. And for some reason I thought that was a good idea. So, all right, so we're using the Cone Amo. Let's see what it can do. It has the word aim in it. So I'm hoping the aim is pretty good. The name is Amo. So I'm hoping it helps me aim Mo at your head. <laughs> okay. What's the f Hey, bitch! I don't know what it is. I think this mouse is just not great. <laughs> really though, this mouse is actually pretty good. I definitely recommend having one that has a thumb button right there at the bottom, opposed to just these two right here. Because really, if you think about it, you can have the floor or you can have a ramp or a wall just by smashing your thumb down. And then the other two options can be right here. So literally the whole building process can just be done with your thumb without even having to move it. So. This uh, Amo is actually pretty good, and I really think best LEDs out of all the mice that we have today. Last mouse, this is the Rocat Leader. Let's give it a shot. I mapped the thumb button at the bottom for the floor. I did ramp, wool, I did inventory for each weapon. We'll see how it goes, I, I don't know. <laughs> I know this wasn't the most technical video in the world, but I'm not trying to make that. I'm just trying to actually test it out for real, see how I like it. Is it too heavy? Is it too small? And most importantly, is it gonna help me win a game in Fortnite? So I think the Pure is what I would say is not my favorite because of the fact that it is so small and light. It didn't really work for me, but the Leader not only does it have the wireless factor with the dock and everything, but it was just a nice fit to my hand. And I, I definitely see myself winning some games with that. The reason I'm even making this video in the first place is because these mice are available right now on a drop on Mass Drop. I'll leave a link to it down below. You definitely don't want to miss it. It's going to be the lowest price you can get each of these mice for respectively. So definitely go click the link, check out the pricing on the one that catches your interest the most and go buy it because there's no other time to get it at a price like it is right now. So go check out the drop down below in the description. If you guys don't know what Mass Drop is, it's a community of tech enthusiasts that's over over 5 million people and they actually partner with brands that the community picks to create and sell insanely awesome products at the lowest price you'll find on the web. So again, check out these mice. They're on a drop right now and they will be gone soon. So definitely click the link in the description and get it while you can. Anyways, with that said, don't forget, I'm Matt Philly and you're not. Get out of my face. Have a great day and I'll catch you on the flippity flop.